Hi everyone, this is Ryan with creatingawebsiteguide.com. Today I just want to show you how to easily create a free ebook cover. If you're creating an ebook or a free report or something like that, it's nice to have a nice looking cover um, to show your product and give it a little bit more um, credibility as well. So you can see um, kind of what our ebook cover looks like on our website. We have a, an ebook called Eight Steps to a Successful Business Website, and this was created using all free tools on the internet. So it might not be as polished as if you pay um, some of the programs out there. I think they're charging up to $300. Um, but if you're a small business and you don't have that budget, um, we're basically going to show you how to bootstrap that right now. So what you're going to need is free photo editing software. Um, I'm using Windows, and on Windows I like to use paint.net. Um, there's a link below uh, if you're on YouTube or if you're on the website there's a link um, at the bottom of this. Um, otherwise there's plenty of other programs you can use. We also have a link at the bottom of this to seven free photo editing software programs that you can use um, as well. So I'm going to open paint.net here real quick. When I open that, um, this isn't the dimensions I want for my ebook cover. Um, this looks more like a children's books dimension. I want something that's more vertical. So we're going to go to image on the top tier and we're going to resize it. So the width we're going to change to 400 and the height we're going to leave at 600. So this is just to give us a basic aspect ratio um, that makes it look more like a book. So once we have that we can design it however we want. I'm not going to get much into the design of it. If you want to look at possible designs um, you can go to just Google and type in ebook covers and from that do a quick image search and you'll see a ton of different ebook covers and kind of how people are designing them. Um, in, this, uh, in this example we'll do a quick and dirty one. I'll add a gradient here real quick. Uh, we'll make it blue. Make it come down here. Make it feel uh, kind of like the ocean I guess. And then we're going to add some text. We'll make it a little bit bigger. Let's go to 26 and make our font something that I like personally a little bit more. We're going to center it make the font white because of the blue background and let's just call our book how to create a free ebook cover pretty creative right so now that we have that let's just add by Ryan Schmitz make this a little bit smaller okay so we have a basic book cover it's not too pretty but you can get the gist of what you can do here um, now that we have our basic cover, we're going to want to create a side cover. So the side cover is what you see on the side of the book, obviously. And if you have something like a gradient or some kind of color that continues onto the side of the book from the main type, the main book, excuse me, um, you would just take your highlighter and paint on that to the top left here, the select, and we're just going to copy that. So we're going to copy that, okay, and then we're going to open a new, a new item. Let's make the width of our side cover 80, and then the height is still going to remain 600. So now that we have that, we're going to paste the gradient, okay, and let's just drag it over exactly to the side so that it continues, okay, and now you have your sidebar. And usually there's the title of the book on the sidebar cover as well. So what we can do, uh, since we can't type in, um, you know, from down to up in this, we're going to take our image and we're going to rotate it 90 degrees clockwise. So, and that's going to give us a sideways image here. And then from that, we're going to add text. So, how to create a free ebook cover. Okay, we'll move our text here, maybe make it slightly bigger. White probably wasn't the best choice here, but you can kind of see anyways. Okay, and then the image, now we're going to rotate it again 90 degrees counterclockwise so that it looks the same. So this is our side cover. So now that we have these two things, we're going to save them. So I'll just save these to my desktop. I'll save this as ebook side. I usually save things as a JPEG file which is just .jpg and make sure that it's also the right file type .jpg as well. 
on the bottom here. So we're going to save that ebook side. Okay. And then we're also going to save our main cover. So save as ebook cover.jpg. Save. I already have one like that, so I'm just going to file over it. Okay. Now that we have these two saved, we're going to go back uh, to our browser. And we're going to go to 3d-pack.com. 3dpack.com um, is an absolutely free tool to use. Um, you can create your own ebook based on images you created. So we're going to choose the cover here, ebook cover, and then we're going to choose our side, which was ebook side. And then we're just going to hit create 3D box. Takes a minute or so to load. Okay, and we can see this is our ebook, and we can move it around from any angle. We didn't deal with the back at all because the angle that I'm going to use at least is kind of like this. So, and now once you have it rotated the correct way and how you want it, I'd like it like this. All you have to do is click on what file type you'd like. We're going to save it as a JPEG. So, just click on JPG. Takes a minute again to load. And you actually have an image here, which you can just right click on and save it or copy it um, either way. So, there you have it. This is how to easily create a free ebook cover. Um, and again, this is Ryan with creatingawebsiteguide.com.